hey, hey. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Jasmine. If this is your first time here, hi, welcome. Don't forget to join the fam before you leave today by subscribing to my channel. Also, click the little notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. So today, I'm going to be sharing the new Morphe Highlight Contour Palette with you guys. I picked it up last week. I got it last week. So this is the palette here. This is the Highlight and Contour Palette. This is a deeper version of it is called 8H Hi-Fi and this is a lot inside of the palette here there are four contour shades and four highlight shades now these contour shades are kind of on the light side of town so there was really only one shade that I could use on my skin tone and that was fabulous because you know I'm just kidding I did swatch them so you guys can see what they look like on my arm. And as you can see, the deeper shade here is fabulous. The other three are definitely too light for me. But if you are lighter than I am, then you could definitely use those to contour your face. Shade Fabulous does run a little bit red. Um, it's definitely not as deep as Showman's. So you guys, this is Showman's in the Morphe Brontor palette. And this is how deep Showman's is compared to this one, Fabulous. Showman's doesn't... Um, Showman's is also not as red as Fabulous is, as you can tell. Okay, so these are the four contour shades, Donut, Debutante, Blogger, and Fabulous. And then you have four highlight shades. So I'm going to swatch the highlight shades so you guys can see what they look like on my skin tone. The first one is called Beam, and these look like they may be from the other highlight collection, because I see one of the shades that looks familiar. Beam is definitely like not what I would use. It's more uh, like a pearly, yellowy, silver color. I would not use that for highlighting. There is Mirage, which I do own the full size of Mirage. Then there is Big Bang, which reminds me of Trophy Wife from Fancy Beauty. It's not as yellow. It's more of a wearable version of Trophy Wife. It's definitely like gold, but it has some yellows in there. So it reminds me of that color. Just more wearable. And then there's Venus, which is kind of like a champagne-y color. Right here. So these are the four highlights. They're not like boom, like in your face type of highlights. They're kind of just mellow. I don't know. They're not like super like boom, you know? Like, all right. So I'm going to just contour the other side of my face so you guys can see that on camera. So I'm going to do this side. I'm going to just put that in here. And run that back now you can see like it looks a little bit red but it's just not the color itself is not dark to the point where it looks crazy the if the contour was darker the red would look crazy but since it's not super dark the red doesn't stand out as much it doesn't look as crazy you know so I'm just gonna contour my face like I just took away my whole forehead you guys like I just contoured the whole thing away I'm gonna sharpen up down here a little bit just a little bit nice and sharp all right so we're nice and contoury I'm gonna play around with the highlights a little bit to show you guys all right so I'm gonna use this brush here from Sigma this is the Sigma tapered highlighting brush F35. Yeah, I'm not a fan of the formula as well. It, it reminds me of Trophy Wife. The formula is like very almost glittery, but not really. It looks like Trophy Wife, but just not as pigmented. I'm going to add a little bit of Mirage on top of that one. Just to see what that looks like. Because I, I would not wear this on its own. Maybe with Mirage. Like... This is, this is just, no. <laughs> no. I don't like this. Uh, I think I definitely, I definitely put too much on, but I still don't like the color. I don't know. I'm okay with Mirage, but Big Bang is just not my cup of tea. It's just a little bit too yellow for me. And I don't like the formula either, so I would pass on that one. I would pass on every shade in here except Mirage, which... I have the full size of and yeah <laughs> all right you guys so that is basically it on this palette I do like it but I don't really feel like it's worth getting the entire palette like I would recommend getting a bronzer that you really loved and then just 
using your favorite highlight because honestly like I'm not a big fan of most of these highlights like I'm not really a big fan contour shades are just not I feel like they're not consistent like they just go from being very neutral to just being super red and the super red one although it looks okay I just it's just not the perfect contour palette is what I'm trying to say and I think they could do a lot better job with it and I kind of cute I don't know why I should I think they should have included this shade in this palette and it would have been better just I don't know anyways you guys that is it for the video I hope you enjoyed it if you did like this video comment below and I'll see you guys in my next one